Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you guys exactly how to get voice chat on Roblox Mobile. So if you want to get voice chat then it's really simple so I'll just bring you through all the steps that you have to do to get it. So there is one method where you can get it without an ID possibly and there's another one where you just use your ID so I'll show you guys both of them. So first things first, let's hop right into the video and let's head straight over to the settings. So click on the three dots in the bottom right corner of the screen and then click on settings. Now once you go to settings you're going to want to head over to account info and the method without an ID, it's pretty simple. You just have to verify your phone number and your email address. And if you're older than uh, 13, as you can see, this is as 1987, that's not my actual birthday, but if it is older than 17 or 13, then you might be able to get voice ID or voice chat without an ID. You just have to wait a couple days, and if you get it, then you get it. If you don't, then you don't. But that is the first method. So just verify your phone number, your email address, and then verify your ID. Uh, and then you just have to make sure that your account is over 13 years old and then you might be able to get it without verifying it but if you haven't gotten it then don't worry so i'll show you the guys the other method with your id so if you aren't actually older than 13 you can actually just make an account on your parents name and with your parents age and they can just verify it with their id but now that we got that out of the way you want to make sure that it's the right age i'm going to make sure this is the right age as well so you want to head over and you want to make sure that you have if you have to go over to two-step verification and verify anything that you need to like I, and once you get the code you can just go ahead and put that in real quick and then once you've verified it you just have to wait and then you can go ahead and verify your age with an id so it's going to ask you to start a session with your prepare a valid id and then start the session so i'm going to go ahead and do that right there it's going to bring you to a different page on some browser probably your default browser for so for me that's safari it's going to load for a bit, it's going to take a bit of time, and then once it's loaded, it's going to ask you to begin ver verifying. So go ahead and do that. It's going to load for a bit more, this takes a lot of time. Not that much time actually. So go ahead and select what country your government ID is from. Mine is from the United States, so I'll choose that. And it's going to ask you to choose which one it is. So mine is actually a driver's license, so I'm going to choose that as well. Now it's going to ask you to take a clear photo of the front of your driver's license. So go ahead and get your driver li driver's license out, and then you want to take a photo of it. So I'm going to blur this out, of course, because I don't want you guys to get it. But as you can see, I'm going to go ahead and take a picture of this. So once you've taken a photo, you're going to want to click use this photo. And it's going to ask you to switch to the back of the ID. So go ahead and flip it. And then you want to take a photo of that as well. So once it's done, you just want to take a photo of that. And then you're going to want to use that photo as well. Now, once you've done that, it's going to load for a bit. And it's going to process your ID. Now once it's processed your ID, it's going to ask you to actually use your camera to take a couple selfies of yourself. So let me go ahead and process the ID real quick and then I'll be right back. Now it's going to ask you to make sure that's you, so you're going to position yourself in the center of the camera and then move your face left and right to show both the sides. So if you're using your parents ID, you're going to have to have them do this as well. But you just want to click get started and you want to center yourself on the screen. So mine actually is not loading, but it should load in a bit, there we go. You want to center yourself on the screen. Now once you do that, you're going to want to look slightly left. You just have to go through that real quick. And once you're done going through that process, it's going to load for a bit. It's going to verify it real quick. So just wait until it's verified. And then as you can see, congratulations, you're done. Thanks for verifying your identity. So now you can head back over to the Roblox app. And it's going to load for a bit. And if you actually head over to the settings, and you head over to settings, head over to privacy, as you can see right here, I should now, as as you can see, I have the option to chat with my microphone. So as you can see here, I can enable microphone, and that is how you can do it. As you can see, I can enable microphone, it works. So that is how you verify your ID or get voice chat on Roblox Mobile. So I hope this video was helpful. If it was, I'd really appreciate a like and subscribe. Leave any questions you have in the comment section below, I'll do my best to answer them, and I'll see you guys next time.